Welcome to the project demonstration of GSM based agriculture motor control using Arduino. So here we are going to control this motor so which is used to pump the water into the fields through the SMS. So here uh, to this GSM module we uh, inserted the uh, SIM card. So while you are demonstrating the project my suggestion is to use the ATL SIM card only it will work for ATL and VI and BSNL also so but other than Geo, so Geo won't work as it's a LTE SIM cards so it needs LTE network so up to 4G you can use that so better to use ATL SIM card in this so insert the SIM card in this manner with micro SIM adapter so check the notch and insert in this manner so push to lock push to unlock so when we want to control this motor we need to send the SMS to the SIM card as a small letters of motor on so the motor will get switched on with the help of this electromagnetic relay and so called status will be displayed on the LCD screen and if you want to off the motor same small letters MOTOR OFF space OFF then automatically the motor will get switched off and the so called status will be displayed on the LCD screen and if you want to check the status of the motor then we need to send the GET small letters so then uh, the, the system will reply to the number about the motor status whether it is on or off so like this we are going to receive the statuses so when you on the kit then the system will uh, inform to the user about the system got switched on and when you send the motor on the motor will get switched on and when you get the get the motor will get it will reply the motor is on status and we can off the motor also so here the whole system uh, run by this Arduino Uno board which will taking care of input from the GSM module and control the output module through this electromagnetic relay and the so called status continuously displayed on the LCD screen. So coming to the interfacing connections, the relay interface at the pin number 10, GSM module at the pin number 8 and 9 and LCD at the pin number 2 to pin number 7. So before on the gauge, first of all connect the battery power supply to the water pumping motor and then on the power supply. So after we switch on the power supply, so the system will display the welcome message and here you can see there is a red light is blinking fast on the GSM module. So once it got the signal, then automatically the blinking red slow down, right? We can see that the blinking red is slow down. Now reset the Arduino once. Yes. So this is on our reset switch. So press and release. Then the system will send the message to the user about the system got switched on after you got the message then you can reply to the same number right so we got the messages system is on so now all our small letters motor space on right so motor got switched on and now just i want to see the status of the motor through message so on LCD we can see that so you can see that we'll send the motor on then turn on so I'm send the get message keep ready with the motor off message so the motor is on now so I'm setting the motor off Yeah, right so so right so now if I want to get the status again right so we got the motor status also so like this we can control the motor from anywhere in the world directly by using uh, GSM technology just send a message so only thing is you should know the signal status then only we can control the motor without any hassle